Bloop bloop, welcome back to the next loop in Outer Wilds. I just restarted with 30 FPS. The video will be not as smooth, but... Well, actually, it, it was not as smooth already, since my encoder didn't get along. And skipped some frames, apparently. At least the video looked like it, so... Yeah. Let's just hope this helps. You know what? It helps tremendously. I'm only at 30 now. 30%. We want to go... Let's go to the radio station this time. Mm. No, I need to be quick if I want to go to the twins. Let's go to the twins again. I mean, we have to be quick. It's fine. Just, just as quick as possible to the twin. So we're there before that stuff starts and go back into the... Come on. Oh, damn it. It happened again. Uh, go back into the... Into the city, into the Sunder City, and find out what's happening with the with the specimen there and stuff. You know, with our specimen, like uh, the fish, the fish. We need to go to the fish. Yeah, that's way better. My CPU is now in a way better shape right now. Oh, that's not good. Um. So the process hasn't started yet. I'm I'm curious what causes it. Wait. Can I get in there? Okay, so thanks that you do that on your own. No. I can't go in there. Sadly enough. And there's a ghost matter cave. Yeah, no. Thanks. Thank you. There's some sand in the core here. Well, there's something in the core. Interesting. But we need to go... There's a bridge. Yeah, there was no sand. They caused this. They must have caused this. There was nothing here. Ow, ow, yes, it hurts. Sometimes stuff must hurt, it's fine. Okay, we're back here? Where's the stupid ship? And it, it started, darn it. Okay. Let's just quickly land. And get into it. Get back in there before the sand rises, and we need to figure out and explore what's happening there. I wish I could just, you know, be a little bit quicker through through running, but, you know, this helps too. Just blasting through it. Uh, wait, this is new. We didn't read this. Friends, if you find any sign of Coleos, I implore you to tell me that he vanished without a trace during our research trip and has been missing ever since. Melore, some of us from the Sunder City are here to help search for Coleos. Can you tell us more about your expedition? You have my gratitude, Burr. Coleos and I were studying the cave's geology. We hope to learn more about a unique and wandering rock that visits several different caves in this area. Oh, I need to scan this one. Where was young Coleos lost, Melore? He disappeared in the cave uh, at the bottom of the dry lake bed at the North Pole. It happened in an instant without any warning. I turned away from Coleos to examine a sample, and when I turned back, he simply wasn't there anymore. He was on the rock, probably. He had a limited supply of air and nonna, I'm afraid for him. Hypothesis, we will learn more by examining the northern lake bed cave where Coleos disappeared. Search quickly, everyone. We have no time to squander. And there we are. Well, that's good. Now we have number two. And there he's gone, uh, gone again. Well, that was nice. Thank you for that. <laughs> that was quick. Oh god. What? That is a strange lump. Uh, I wasn't here before though. Hey, Pretzel Factory. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. I guess the okay was for the press F5 because I had to restart the stream. Yeah, but my CPU is now only at 40%. Now everything is going fine. Oh, the lake bed. 
Oh god, this is horrifying. Uh, but maybe we should go here. Oh my god, there's so much to explore. I could probably spend a few thousand parts here. Okay, this is the bridge you've seen. Interesting. I'm already losing time for the Sunless City exploration. God damn it. Uh, the rock is back? Hello? Very interesting. Coleus is missing. He vanished from the lake bed. Uh, bottom of the dry, yeah, 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 several days ago, and we are unable to find any trace of him. I don't know how much air he had when he disappeared. I beg any friend reading this, help us recover him. This rock is very familiar. Did you travel here by a sed sedimentary friend? Because your unique color and texture appears identical to a rock I met earlier, because it is. Wasn't this same rock fragment in the cave we found at the bottom of the dry lake bed at the North Pole? We plan to re-examine the northern lake bed cave. Maybe our friendly rock will meet us down there. An update, Meloran, I went back to the lake bed and observed this rock again. Sometimes it's there and sometimes it isn't. That means this rock wanders like the quantum moon does. Curious. Yeah, because it's probably part of that moon. We were at the lake bed, but the, s the sand is rising. And there's probably no way we can reach it anymore. The, the cave down there, because I would like to. Get the last hint for this rock. We can try. I, I think it's this. Oh god, that's so... Rising. And scary. Damn, always this, this time pressure here. <laughs> Oh, uh, it's really messing messing my exploration up. Okay, that's not the cave though. I'm just going up. Was the cave already filled with sand? Do I have to be even quicker? Um, apparently. But this is the North Pole. Where's the cave? Yeah, it was probably too late. Darn it. It's already rising too quickly. I think we'll just, uh, you know, give up for this. And come back as quickly as possible. Just no, no use waiting. For the sun to explode. It's better just coming here, going here directly to the North Pole if we can. Going into the cave and then as quickly as possible to the Sunless City. So we can still explore. Unfortunately, it takes a while until we get to this planet and the sand already starts falling down. And I try not to dilly daddle at all. But damn that, you need to be quick. There you go. Go in there. Just so I don't forget later. Damn, this game is just amazing. I love it. Where is... Where are the twins? First, where's the sun? Okay. Okay, just let the autopilot get our trajectory in order, then stop it and go fast. ASAP. And yeah, we will observe this, whatever happens there, from its perspective too. Uh, later. Of course. Come on! Burn against this! Burn against this! Come on! Too late already, I think. I think the autopilot would have been more efficient. Too late in terms of it already started. Okay. Now, let's just find this lake bed again. That is not it. That's the cannon. 
There's something else there next to the cannon. Good to know. It's possible to go there at the end, but I need to find the North Pole. That's not the North Pole. I don't like that I don't have this holographic representation. Ah, there it is. Without, um... Without just sitting on the surface. I think when you go near, you should already have this. Because the North and South Pole are so important. Sometimes. That you should just have this. Okay, sand is going. I hear it. I hear it starting up. This cave will fill really quickly, so we need to be very quick about all this. There's no... nothing here. There's a pole representa representation of the landing camera. There is! Oh! Yeah, okay, maybe that, that is what I missed so far. Um... Um, there's nothing here? Wait, what? That is the cavern they meant, right? The sand is already here. So, the stone must be here, somewhere. Huh. And we're gonna die soon. Where's the sand coming from? That must be horrible to watch right now. Okay. Um, sand is coming from here. Ow. Can't do shit. Damn it! Ah, I can't, I can't, I can't do anything. So this is probably not it, I guess. And hello, I, I clue, I'm sorry, I'm just a little bit busy right now. Ah, I can go here, I just need to hit the right spots. You know, you need to hit the right notes. Hopefully it's not... Too late already. And your fuel only recovers when you stand on the surface. Okay, no, not too late apparently. Where am I? <laughs> I have no clue. I can't really see anything through the sand. Okay, I'm here. Where is here? Oh, what? Are these things made from the same sto- oh, yeah, they are. They are quantum plants or something. Uh, can't get through here anymore. Why do they appear? Look, and now they're gone. What the frick is happening with this? <laughs> oh god. Please go away again, thank you. Please go away again, thank you. Okay, I'm through. Go away again. No. Go away. Oh god! Uh... I cannot go through un unless they're there, so... I have to push through? I can't. Well, that's just great. Oh, now they're gone. Good, 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 good. Go away, please. Don't leave rocks. Ah, oh, damn it. Go away again. Thank you. Damn, this is hell. This is pure hell here. Don't have any more fuel. Okay, where are we? That's the rock. Your scout can uh, also be handy as an extra light source. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. The jumps are just tricky. They are. 
I'm enjoying listening to your stream at work. Oh. Oh, great. Yeah, there's nothing new here. We already have the frequency of this one unlocked. And a few people died in here. We will too. Uh, if you come here to look for Coleos, this is where we were when he vanished. He's been missing for two days now. Your strange wandering rock friend is here? Uh, though Coleos isn't. Coleos and I observed this unusual looking rock shard and several smaller rocks and at least two other caverns. I'm sure I'm not unsure if this is relevant. What happened before Coleos disappeared? We were examining the different rocks. I recall Coleos standing on the largest one, the wandering rock. I was taking notes and then my lantern died. When I lit it up again, Coleos and the rock were both gone. But we were in the caverns. Okay. That's light. But I can't do that myself, right? I can't just wander with him. Is the problem. I don't know what the light does. Um, what the heck? The light thing is wandering too? Why is the light thing wandering? What? That thing doesn't make any... Nothing makes sense in here. Yeah, I mean, I can summon it when I want to. And the light thing is wandering by its... I have no idea what to do here. I mean, we're gonna die. That's for sure. But can I use this light thing to my advantage? In in the... The, the plant is wandering too. Everything is wandering here. My god. Um, can I use that to my advantage and, and vanish with the rock? I don't think so, because I can't do this with the rock well, while standing on it you know and vanish too because I need to be observed with this thing mm. it's literally everything wandering in here that's ridiculous <sighs> welcome to the quantum world yeah but why is everything quantum now not only this rock does it exert a I don't know, a, a radiation that causes this? And the problem is getting here is really tricky and I don't want to do that again if I have if I don't have to. And it it has no it has no signal anymore. It did in the other cavern, but now it doesn't. Oh yes it does. Okay, I just have to go to the frequency here. It's already enough. <laughs> it's there, it's gone. It's there, it's gone. Oh my god. I have no idea what to do here. Uh, I don't know if I can trigger that I go with... It. Oh my god, that is so ridiculous. That I go with it. Oh. Were you standing there all along? And that's the only time this thing is on the left side right now. Yeah, and look, the, the skeleton isn't standing anymore. So it happens to the skeletons too. Yeah, it does. They all wander. Everything wanders in here. That is strange, guys. And sometimes it's standing. You'll figure something out eventually. Yeah, I don't think before we die. And I don't want to come back here right now. 
There must be a way. I really have no idea. Why are you standing is the question. And now another one was standing there. I mean, what I can do is use that thing to exert light. But the question is, does that make... It vanished. Okay. It vanished and is in inside of the rock now. And now the rock doesn't come back. That's cute and all. But I have no idea where this is. <laughs> it must be another cave or something? Okay, let's get that back. Get the rock back. Uh, and now you're complete. That is, that is ridiculous. Um, maybe I can complete the skeletons this way or something? Something horrible? Okay. Don't know where that is. That was strange. So this is observing, apparently. For some reason. Uh, okay, you're complete, but you're not. Let's try that again. Okay, and you're observing now, right? Yes, you're observing. So, without using the camera, you're gone. Huh. And I'm not observing the right things, apparently. Because only one skeleton is complete. So I need to find them, is that the thing? It's the same cavern again. I guess I have to find the child somehow, but... That's not gonna do it. <laughs> I don't even know what cavern this is. Wait. It's this cavern. How... How... What? How did it come back? Yeah, look at that. It just came back. Oh my god, the skeletons are changing because of the camera now. That is... That is fucking scary. How can that thing be... How can that thing be observing? It's not a... Well, it is an observation in, in some way. Oh, God. Give me some more oxygen. I'm not dead yet, so we'll experiment a little bit. So it is observing. And they, don't, they are not van vanishing. And now it's back. How is it back? It must have observed the rock and then it didn't. Like now. Those are stairs, I think. So now I can make a jump. I have still have no idea where it is, just now it's here. It's always going back to this place. They're just jumping between those two. But there was a third one. God, I have no idea what the, how this works. Come back. Oh god, the skeleton makes me go crazy. Oh, and it's filling with sand, so we're dying now. Ain't that a bitch. Back here again. 
back gone. I don't know where that is. Do I need to go there? Oh, and now we're done. Well, guys, that was this loop. The skeletons are not really relevant, just fun, okay. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. How should I know? Yeah, we're dead. Smooshed. One of the ideas I mentioned was pretty good. Wow. Well, the question is, does it help if I go back? I don't think so. I'm out of ideas. Nothing works. Nothing does anything. Oh, yes, it does. Yes, I know which idea you mean. Okay, being observed, because I figured out that the camera is observing. Okay, let's go back once, one more, one time, another time. Just go back there, go to the rock cave and do that again, because I think we can jump with it. Through the scout. Yes, that makes sense, but, uh, well, <laughs> in this strange world it does. We just need to be quick, because that cave is hard to find. Well, we don't even need to find that cave if that works, because we can jump from any cave to any cave. Actually. Don't we? We just need to find him once, and then we can jump between the caves. Question is, does that make any difference for us? Because we visited all the caves, in my opinion, and there was nothing there. Uh, if you keep trying, you'll probably get it, but you could also go away and come back to it later. Yeah, that's the thing. Of course I can, but... What makes more sense now? Oh. There's something we haven't seen. Well, that's interesting. Probably the worst position to land, but who cares. The planet's in relation to this one, okay. Interesting. So like the one we found on our moon. This planet sometimes and only sometimes has a moon. This is also of note. It, it disappears if no one is watching it. It's, isn't that a fascinating orbital characteristic? Yeah. I found your note, Meloray. Kindly count me among this moon's admirers. What is happening when it disappears? I doubt it ceases to exist. Does anyone... Uh, does it move to another location? I believe so, but only does the moon appear around Brittle Hollow. I can confirm it. Uh, not only does it, uh, sometimes orbits Timber Earth as well. This is my first time encountering a natural satellite with the ability to vanish when not being watched. We should study it, or even better, we should travel there. Yeah, that would be nice. I would like that. I agree. Our first step would be determining a method to track this phantom moon so that we can always know where it is. Yeah, and, and we can't. Given its reluctance to move while consciously observed, uh, it might be a form of macroscopic quantum mechanics. Which doesn't make any sense, since quantum mechanics is everything but not macroscopic. Let's just read this for now. Church research notes, property of church. Clearly the Nomai were making astronomical observations here, they chose an excellent spot. What is this big rotation device for? What was it the Nomai were observing? The position of the planets, obviously. I'd posit there's... I posit there's something special about the orange symbol on that device. Hell and the new astronauts translator tool would be nice to have handy about now. Yeah, it would be. Well, I, I do have it and it's, it's really nice. Let's read this real quick. We need more inf information. That's that's always imperative. And time freezes anyway when I do this. The quantum moon locator is functioning. We have markers for each of the places the moon goes. Okay, this is the quantum moon locator. Amona Burr, I just observed the quantum moon in orbit around Dark Bramble. You have keen eyes, my friend, so this moon travels uh, to a total of five locations, not four. I added a marker for Dark Bramble. I thought the locator now accounted for all of the phantom moon's locations, but sometimes the locator can't tell where the moon is. So it goes to the eye? Well, that would make sense that I can't go there yet. Perhaps there's a problem with the device. 
It's also possible there exists a sixth place in the star system to which the phantom moon travels. Yeah, that makes more sense at this point. That is the moon? This must be the moon then. But I can't observe it right. Oh, there it is. Okay, so now. Yeah, now it's here. Okay. So it locates the moon. Interesting. Well, let's go into one of these caves. Let's just search around. If we find one of the caves, we find all of the caves, so... We just need to find the canyon here and go to one of the bridges. Like this one. And we know where one of the caves should be. Oh god, or oh, I just die. That's also cool. I mean, we can just restart. It's fine. Ow. Um... Uncool. Because now I can't get back up. Well, that's just great. Just let me stand here for a second. No, come on, let me stand. Gravity is not good enough to use my... Uh, it's, it's not low enough to use my jetpack. Normally, I just I need to use the boost. Damn it. Um, I'm alive still. Although that should kill me. Uh, and it does. Okay. Yeah, I can't go away. So we're dead. <laughs> okay. So we can use the camera, but I need to find the stupid, stupid place where we need to, where we need to get on the stone. <gasps> the only explanation where the where the boy went to is that it must travel to a fourth cave, not only three. Because they didn't find them. Question is, where is it? And it really stresses me out that we have so little time to do anything on that planet. Really stresses me out. It's like Brittle Hollow. So much for the, the stuff will be better on the other planets. No, it's not. Everything is so time sensitive and so short. There we are. Come here. We need to the em go to the Ember Twin, not the Ash Twin. We do need to go to the Solar Station. We do need to go to the Ash Twin someday to just figure out what's happening there. Maybe we find some notes. And apparently we're crashing into it right now. I know I let myself uh, be distracted all the time right now. I mean, that happens. It does. It really does. Okay, just go there before that process starts. Oh god, oh god, oh god! Ow! It's fine, everything's fine, nothing's broken, everything's good. Uh, you know what, let's start here again. Oh, it takes so much time though. I don't really like it, but it's, it's of no use anyway. Let's just go there. Maybe I'm quicker this time. There it is, the cave. Should use light, it helps. And the <sighs> But that means that in the city, in the sunless city, there's also these uh, these spiky things. And that means that we can get rid of the spike things and of the s whatever it is blocking our way by not looking at it too long. Or well, looking at it and then, you know, looking away. It's not happening here. Um, for some reason. How did I get through here? Oh god. So, so far it's a labyrinth. A lot of dead ends, so not a maze. That, that's the difference between a labyrinth and a maze. In a maze there are no dead ends. In a labyrinth, there are. No. Where do I need to go? Oh, up. Yeah, sometimes it's hard to discern when you need to go up or somewhere else. Right, 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 right. It's this this part of the of the journey that I enjoy so much. 
Come on. There we are. The, the, the jumps aren't even that tricky. It's just time consuming. Since I can even skip some. But the time consuming is the problem because we are on a on a clock here, guys. <laughs> we are on the clock. Um, ow, ow, I can't get through this, okay. So, now the spiky death things. Hey, Silent Assassin, welcome. Hello. Hope I didn't miss you for too long. Three minutes, okay, I'm sorry. But I'm hyper focused right now here. Yeah. Oh god, go away. Thank no, go away and leave me a space. Thank you. Perfect. Don't come back. God, this quantum nonsense. And we're back. Perfect, 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 perfect. Give me some oxygen. Thank you. Now, I need to go here. At least that's what I figured out so far. And then I need to observe myself. There we are. Not gonna observe anything. I'm not vanishing. Do I need to get rid of the... Okay, maybe I need to get rid of the light. But it exerts light. I'm in another cavern, it works. Oh my freaking god, that is ridiculous. Uh, that is ridiculous. Keep this, keep the stone, please. Yeah, stone is observed, perfect. Um, how curious, this rock took me with it to a new location. I wonder why this happened. I wonder if my, I myself became quantum briefly when the rock carried me here. This seems the clearest explanation. Hypothesis, if the rock can bring me here, it can also carry me out. Haha, <laughs> we didn't have a scout. Curious, but also alarming. This new cave appears to lack an entrance or exit. Also, the rock that brought me here disappeared while, it wa while I wasn't watching. The wandering rock has returned. Never before have I been so delighted to see a sedimentary specimen. My hypothesis was correct. I can travel on this rock as long as I'm not observing my surroundings, meaning I must be in complete darkness. I'm going to bring my mentor here to see this. But you couldn't. Meloray is here now too. We theorize when a conscious being is in contact with a quantum object. So they found him and ceases to act as an observer, explaining the need for darkness. The being cannot become entangled with a quantum object and they move together. Friends, Colius has discovered a new quantum rule. He has also promised me he'll never vanish again, even if he does learn something useful from it. So they found him after days and he's still at oxygen? Oh, great. So that didn't work. But we know now how we can travel with these things. I mean... If that is uh, um, important in any way whatsoever. Um, that didn't work. Okay, so if I'm in darkness, it's fine. Interesting. I don't even need the camera, okay. When the game rewinds, you rewind back to the start of your playthrough, yes? Yes, that's correct. I'm I'm here again. Oh, okay. Well, not quite at the start, but somewhat, because the ship's log still stays intact. But the thing is, even though we figured this out, we are done. We can't do anything else here anymore, because we cannot reach the Sunder City anymore. It's probably already completely... Uh, engulf with sand because that took a while, but we found another clue. I mean, that's cool If we can be in darkness, that's fine I can't get in there. I need to go th through the Sunder City So yeah, I think we just restart the loop and try to go through the Sunder City again 
Because I don't think it would matter here. We can try. I, I need to find my way quicker. Into this. Oh, my scout is here. Oh, look at that. <laughs> That's cool. Hey, Manaway, welcome. How are you doing? Uh, I'm here. That's not that's not the Sunder City. What the hell? How do I get to that again? There was an entrance from the from the thing. Oh, the rock is back. Hey, Mr. Rock. And it was through here, wasn't it? Am I insane now? Oh, it's the wrong side of the ship. Isn't it? Hey, if you would have a critical, I don't care. I need to figure that out for the la for the next loop. Read all that, read all that. Fine, fine, fine. Yes, fine, fine, fine. Ah, yeah, we have to go through the ship. Okay, cool. Good that we figured that out. Um, maybe we can get the fish going, though. We heard we need to place the scout in its maw. And it'll guide us uh, the way. Oh yeah, but we need to reach the city first. Haha. <laughs> Where was it again? Oh god, no. Oh god, no. Oh god, no. Uh, we didn't read this one. Of note, this passage leads to breathable air. Refill your supply tank there. We cannot tell how far or deep these tunnels may wind. But do not linger as the area is exposed to the heat of the alien sun. Well, let's just figure it out. Because our oxygen is being depleted. There we go. Refill your air supply tank and return quickly. Yeah. Uh, even worse now. Oh, and I can't boost anymore. Yeah, that, that is our death. We need to boost through. Okay, I think this iteration is over. Next time we go to the city... Let me just kill myself. So, be quick. There's still a lot of the Sunder City to go through. We on the on the Ember Twin, by the way, Manaway. Hope you had a good day today. My day was rather frustrating. Rather frustrating. Nothing worked. And I got a bug that no one else has. It's just amazing. Unfortunately, the bug was not the th in the thing that I was testing, or was trying to test. So, haha. I did! Oh, that's nice. I had a great day. Well, that's perfect. I'm happy for you. Well, I'm streaming because we had... We have gotten a great message, so... A motivating one. And then I thought, well, you know, let's just stream. It's fine. It's cool. Come on, go there. Quickly, please. I'm, I'm curious about the Sun Station too, but why aren't you going there? But I'm not yet ready to go there. Don't even know if we can. Okay, unfortunate. It's the wrong one. Just about the autopilot and we'll just run in there. There's the there's the thing we want to go to. So we have to go through the inside of this to reach the city. Which is very interesting. And I already saw something I want to explore again. Oh, we should go through the lock too. But not right now, I guess. No, 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 no! You... Damn it! Stupid thing. Why don't you do what I want from you? Because I'm dumb. Corrosion. Okay, let's go through here. Be quick about it. Every second we save now, we can use later. I think that was the city, right? Yes. We should be able to go through here very quickly. The sand just started. 
There's not much going down there for now. Did we have to go through here? Uh, doesn't seem to be the case. Need to follow these. Yeah, 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 there. Down there. Okay, so through here, then to the left, then up. In the cave with all the stalactites and stalagmites. Here. There's up. There we go. Takes so many iterations to get figure all of this out. Okay, we need to go through here. And I'm still... I still think I'm missing stuff. Okay. Yeah, we need to go up, not down. That's important. There we are. Sunder City, here we come. And no, I'm not forgetting this. I want to know what this does. What we can figure out here. Because we will meet these things. Uh, no, I need to meet... Uh, I need to hit the, mo the maw. Okay, and now it'll show us the way through the other cave. That's what we heard. We'll look at that today. Well, in this iteration, rather. Uh, let's... Make, uh, let the city come alive again. There we go. Uh, we should probably start down there, right? Before everything... Oh god. Fills with O2, uh, with O2, with the sand. What is this? The high energy lab. Oh. Oh, we need to be quick to get here. Okay. Well, that sucks. What's going on in here? Not much, apparently. Mm. Not much at all. It's just the way up. So, high energy lab it is. We can we can see the fish the next iteration. If this is so intensive, okay, it provides us with energy. Oh no. Uh, can I even get through there until the sand is is high enough? I doubt it. Nope, I can't. Well, that's just peachy. Yeah, because I can't... Well, that sucks. <laughs> God damn it, game. Why? Why do you do this to me? So it forces me to wait here. Yeah, now death is coming. Can I go above? Well, there is something going on there. There are stairs. Okay. Come on. Mechanisms. Nope, I'm back here now. And I couldn't see. Come on. That's the stepping stone cave. Hmm. So the way to the fish is in here. But also the way to the high energy lab. Which is now closed. I dilly dally too much. Great. So let's go through the stepping stone cave. Uh, which sucks because we haven't done the fish thing. Or did we? Oh, yes, we did. Yes, we did. Yes, we did. So, this is it? But it's not the fish more that showed me the way. Okay. I have no idea where I am. Are we playing the fossil fish game tonight? 
I fed the fossil fish a new lantern. If you go to the stepping stone cave, the entrance of the fossil fish is easy. Gratitude, Solanum, it's... Oh, Solanum, it's good you're small enough to climb through the hole. I'm still small enough. It won't be for long. Mom and Dad are tall, so you and I will be tall too. So we're back in the city where I don't want to freaking be. I want to go to the freaking fish. That's not a stepping stone cave. Where was it? What? It just came from there. I can't see a way though. Didn't we give the f we give gave the fish? Ah. Ah, I'm an idiot. I recalled the scout without wanting to. Oh, so we have to do this again. 60 seconds of oxygen. Well, that's fine. Oh, it's so annoying that we have to do that so much because I'm so dumb. Ow. Okay, next time, high energy lab. Then the fish, I think. But I don't know how to go to the energy lab, to be honest. I don't know how to go there because... Um, it's probably down at the bottom somewhere. We need to be quick. Um, I don't know how to go there because... I can't go through the sands. Do I have to be so quick that the sand didn't even start yet? It's impossible in my mind. It's absolutely impossible. There's no way we can be that quick down here. There's no way. I don't see any entrance that is quick enough. Well, I don't even see any entrance. There's just one. It's tricky. It's really tricky. We'll try again. That's the last thing we'll do in this part. We still have a few hours to figure things out today. <sighs> and now, let me just do this real quick because I just saw that my battery died or is dying on my headset. You know what? We're going to put a, put a cut in here. And next time we'll start with the... Uh, with the high energy lab and in the in the loop after that with the fish. So I hope you're there I hope you enjoyed have a great day or evening or wherever your time zone is right now And I see you in the next one. Bye. Bye and bloop bloop